All right, time to fulfill Charles' request to me. Let's go talk to Rainsfall about the situation that's going on. I, I would say Dutch got him into the situation, but the situation was already going on. Definitely coerced Eagle Flies into doing some dumb shit. So I hope that uh, we can figure out a fix for that or something. Rainsfall. Hello, Rainsfall? Are you out here? In here? Is your tent? I need to talk to you about uh, your son. Hello? Come in. Hello, Rainsfall. <coughs> you don't sound very well. I'm not. I'm, I think I'm dying. Then I hope you find peace. I don't know too much about peace. Apparently not. Did you have fun with my son, the impetuous prince? I believe you went on a raid with him. Um, I'm sorry. I suppose I lack the grandeur of a conventional king. I don't know too many kings. Colonel Favors. He has already exacted some measure of revenge for the raid. I knew Two it wasn't a good were idea. assaulted by his men. Um, I'm very sorry about all of this. Yes. Sometimes the correct path, the bravest path, is the least obvious and also the gentlest. I'm... I'm a great disappointment to my son. Your son seems to want a war. My son... Thinks there is glory in death. Oh, okay. So Maybe you're that kind right. of person. But for me, I saw death being handed out so freely by the most foolish of men. I never could equate it with victory. Glory has come in service. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. I've killed a lot of people for a whole lot of dumb reasons. And I ain't never seen much glory in it. Well, your friend, Mr. Vanderlyn, he talks a lot. I don't know does. him, but my son is easily lit. I'm not sure I get you. Uh, well, perhaps we could go for a ride. I'm an old man. My whole life I have tried to bring peace. But uh, I ain't doing so good. Then maybe you can take pity on my plight, please. It won't take long. <laughs> and maybe I can help you with that cough. Sir! Oh, brother. I'm glad I caught you, sir. Captain Monroe, do you know my friend, Mr. Morgan? No, sir. I don't have the pleasure. Arthur Morgan. It's an honor, sir. How can I help you, Captain? I was just in San Denis. I spoke with the mayor. It's uh -huh. not good news, I'm afraid. What? May I ride with you for a little? Of course. Oh, Where what bad going? news, I what bullshit is happening now? One second, I need to remove this obnoxious red dot off the map. To me. Okay. Alright. Okay. Yeah. Sounds interesting. So, what's what this news you got? News, Captain Monroe? <laughs> That's what I said. As I mentioned, I did speak again with the mayor and the Bureau of Indian Affairs in San Denis at length. But regrettably, it appears the oil company has already received approval to move Shit. forward with drilling on the reservation's land. I suppose this much. So what does that mean for us now? I'm not sure just yet. I didn't get the impression anything would be happening for a few months. I'm very sorry, sir. I did everything I could. Damn, they're actually Captain. getting kicked off their land. I assure you I will continue to do as much as I can. Mr. Morgan, would you have time to help me at all? I would rather certain actions were taken by friends outside the tribe. Sure, of course, I, I can, can help. help you. That's good news. Thank you. Do anything Come I can to help the these guys. You can. Any assistance would be Seems much like appreciated, they really need Mr. some help. I wouldn't want to be in their situation. Damn. Passing you. Okay, sir. <laughs> anyway, gentlemen, I won't take up any more of your time. Bye. I'll see you both soon. Sure. Okay, Thank chief. You, 
Enjoy the ride. Where are we headed, we'll Chief? We'll continue on this way. I'm going to look for some herbs to give you. Some herbs? What the fuck are herbs gonna do for me? I'm dying. I got fucking black clung, Chief. <laughs> my fucking organs are trying to exit through my fucking throat. <laughs> <laughs> See the wolves over there feasting on that horse? Yeah. Brutality and beauty are both all around us. Yet so often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. Doesn't seem to want to learn any lessons. Yeah! Go on, get out of here! Good. There was no need to harm them. Hey, girl! We can't talk if you want, Mr. Morgan. But don't feel like you have to. It's a beautiful ride ahead if you need some time to think. So we'll talk about Eagles Fly. We don't know each other too well, but I wanted to speak to you about your son. I was there on the raid to steal back those horses and uh well why is he riding you know like he's following me? Dutch, I think. Yes, a little. Mostly from your friend Charles. I don't know why Dutch is getting involved in your situation, and this ain't easy to say, but I just don't trust that he's got your son's best interests at heart. So what can we do? I don't rightly know. Charles and I just thought you should be aware. There we go. He's finally Maybe going ahead of me. There's a way to stop <laughs> things from getting. Sorry, uh, hold up a moment. That'll have to wait. What? Some of the plants I need will be growing down here. Oh, you, you really stopped me to tell me that you're gonna go get plants? I think you could have picked the plants without interrupting me. What is it you're looking for? Is that Jensen? Those are just flowers. This is what I was looking for. English mace. English mace. Okay. Let's continue on. Now, I was hmm. Maybe there's a way to stop things from getting any more out of control. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. Let me give this some thought. Arthur's son. You know, I had a son once, years ago. Don't talk about him much. No, what was his name? Isaac. Isaac. His mother, Eliza, was a waitress I met. When she got pregnant, she knew who I was, what my life was. I didn't want to promise nothing I couldn't keep, but I said I'd do right by them. Every few months, I'd stop by there for a few days. He was such a good kid. What happened? She was too, I guess. <laughs> Just a kid, 19. What happened? I got there one day and saw two crosses outside. I knew right away. Turned out some bastards had come through. Robbed oh, no. Them and shot them dead. And offered ten dollars. Oh. Hardened me. Feeling that kind of pain. But I know now that you don't get to live a bad life and have good things happen to you. I think you're being hard on yourself. Mm. Maybe. All I can do is fucked up story, try to make yeah. some things right. Yeah, that's my girl. <laughs> Wait, stop here. I want to pick some ginseng. Ginseng? Yes, of course. Of course. English mace ginseng. Exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> Hmm. This will combine well. For what? I don't even know what you're making yet. How does this help me with my death 
disease. <laughs> Wait there. I'll put these in your saddlebag. Okay. What does it? Why are you putting them in my saddle? I don't know what to do with them. Okay. It tastes awful, but it'll help to keep your strength up. Okay. Sure. All right, let's go. It's done much further now. <laughs> that, was, that was so random. Stay there. I will put these in your bag. <laughs> Mix them together. <laughs> that was it. You're Monroe. Going the wrong way. I'm literally behind you. Yeah. And that feller. Monroe, how you know him? Captain Monroe was reassigned here from a regiment in the north. Apparently, the news of our conflict has spread all the way to Washington. Damn. He's a good man. He wants to help. Well, that's good. I guess that's something, at least. The army aren't all bad men. Just as my people aren't all good. But this colonel favors. He walks an old line. He's obstinate, and he hates Monroe. Of course he I does. I just hope between us we can work this out. Uh, I hope it, I hope it works out for you, Mr. Rainfalls. Hope your son doesn't get into any fucking trouble. I bet he will, though, working with Dutch. Because at this point, working with Dutch is basically just working for Micah. And you don't want to work for Micah. Clearly. So, I'm sorry about- I'm sorry about all this. I'm sorry you got involved with us. Probably would have been better off if you never met me or met Charles, especially if you never met Dutch. Can't change that now, but hopefully I can help you, uh, help you fix things. It's just up ahead. Alright. I don't really ex said where we're going, we've been. What happened? No! It can't oh, be. No. I've I've gone past this thing all the time and I wondered what it was. And now it's gone. No! They've destroyed everything! No, I need to find the Chinupa. Who, uh, a what? Who would do this? What's a Chinupa? Someone who wanted to enrage you. Could have been Dutch. Help me Dutch wants a ward. Please! It's Chinupa. Chinupa's gone. Of course. <laughs> what is it? A uh, ceremonial pipe. There must be some clues to what happened here. Sure looks like they was doing some drinking. What is a Chinupa? Inspect. What we got? A flat? Piece. The army. There's some whiskey here. I see no end to any of this. Ah, moonshine. Oh, some over here. Oh shit. Can I help you find the Chinupa? More whiskey. Bastards are having a party up here. That they were. Let me give this some more thought. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Over here! Found the Chinupa? I, I swear I'm just... I'm like... Well, if they drank all that, they couldn't have gotten too far. Yeah, well... Still no sign of the Chinupa. More drink. This is a place of peace. Over there! Chinupa? The fuck is a Chinupa? Look there! Smoke! Smoke? I don't see smoke from here. Or maybe... Uh, sorry. Come in. Smoke? Where? Quick, Mr. Morgan. There's I'm coming. Down there. 
Oh, I'm here. Smoke where? Do you have any binoculars? I do. There's a whole little camp down there. Oh, there they are. These brave men. They have the Chanupa? Of Colonel Favor's men. Oh, of course they are. They must have been the ones who did this. Are you surprised this happened? Not I would be. But... But I hope we were past this. Well, you got land they want. Land with oil. You think they got your Chanupa? They moved us here. They've taken everything we had. I signed three treaties myself, and they've broken each one. Damn. No, they've taken the last hope. No, my people are going to want a war. A war they can't win. Jesus. Not if I get it back. Get it back? Yeah, I'm gonna go in, get your chin up, and no one will be any the wiser. Would you do that? Yep. Well, you can't go. They know why you'd come. I'm not gonna kill nobody. I'll get it. I, uh, and you'll get your chinupa. Don't have any money. I don't, I don't need, need money. money. I'm gonna do this. Cause you need help. Please see if they have our secret items. But try not to hurt anyone. I will do my best not to kill I'll any souls. Sure they never... Horsey. Tennessee, let's go. Trying to be heroes. You can be my hero, baby. Need to sneak in there and get the chinupa without them ever knowing I was even here. Why are you doing fucking circles, Arthur? All right, gotta figure out how to sneak past all the guards. Get in, steal the chinupa. What even is a fucking chinupa? I feel like I'm just saying a made-up word here. I just feel like I'm insane. Silly. We got an hey, intruder. I heard Shh. Bell, Stop it. Oh, it. Damn it, he saw me. Did I just let him kill me or I guess? I'm going dead. I'm gonna die. I don't wanna hurt anyone, but I don't know where the Chinupa is. I don't even know what I'm looking for. What is a fucking Chinupa? Uh. Chinupa! Wait! Chinupa! Do I have the Chinupa? Oh. I do. I got the stuff. Okay, now I just need to go. Ah! Just need to go. I gotta run. Tennessee! Girl, I need help. Well, nobody died. I mean, I almost fucking did, but I was, I'm dying anyway. Tennessee! Tennessee, get up here. We gotta go. Oh, well. 
That was definitely not how that was supposed to go, but, uh... I got it. <laughs> okay, you're right. That's a tree. I mean, it could have could have gone a lot fucking worse. Honestly, I could have died, but I did not, cause I'm just that good. I'm fast as fuck. <laughs> Rains fall. I have it. Your Chanupa. Please there. tell me you found it. I did. Here. I uh, I got your things, I, I think. Yes. Thank you. I'm very sorry about this. Even sacred things are only things. People, the heart matter more. Was anyone hurt? No one was killed. Well done. Well done. No. Nope. I wish my son knew such restraint. My people owe you a great debt, and I'm giving you very little. What you got? Please, take this. Ooh, a trinket? Leave it to be sacred. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Take those herbs I gave you, please. And most of all, I hope you can find peace within yourself. I hope so too. Good day. Glad I could help. <laughs> Wish I could do some more though. He's a man who, not so long ago, I would have found weak and pathetic. Where is she? Now I see his birdie. Wise, oh, eagle sensible. killed a bird. <laughs> I would love to help him, or at least stop Dutch pushing his son to do some real stupid. 